how to be a real island guy. I'm gonna show you how to crack a coconut. Okay guys, I'm gonna show you how to crack a coconut. I think this is maybe a huge acorn. Ooh. The cool thing about this hotel is that you can get a buggy from reception to our room if it's too far. It's not because we're lazy, it's just really far. Yeah, we're kind of lazy. Maruru! That one didn't work. <sighs> Home. So we just got back. Our beautiful, beautiful room. Like the most important thing about having a room clean here is the bar. It gets topped up and you're allowed as much as you want. But this is astonishing. Bro. Hello. That was the audio. I just put the audio back on. The battery ran out. So I want to show you guys a pro tip. If you guys are wanting to charge your phone, the back of the TV so they have USB ports. Not a lot of people know that. Speakers here. Most speakers have a USB port, so I'm charging the GoPro there. Um, Finn's got his camera charger charged up over there. I've got a laptop over here, and it's not really charging anything, so I'm probably going to charge something on that. With creating content on the go is that making sure your batteries are always charged. I went out with a flat GoPro and a flat drone remote earlier today. In our little fridge, Minano. Minano Tahiti. Coke Cola Light, which is kind of like Coke Zero. Um, and that's all complimentary every day, they top that up, which is nice. And what else do we have? We have these robes. Lights, camera, action. Ooh, here's a window I didn't know about. Why'd you, why'd you move our beds close together? Check that out. Whoa. I've been working out my legs. Now we're gonna go eat lunch. Things you might not know coming to Moria. Moria. Actually, it's pronounced Moria. Don't fall asleep in the sun on the first day. That's a that's a pro tip. Make sure you bring sunscreen. I'm brown, I tan easily, but I also get really red sometimes. If you're gonna go swimming with the stingray and sharks, take some fish bait with you and you will be like freaking Aquaman. We go again for another adventure. However, this time I have triple the amount of sunblock that is on me. When we first got here, the first two days, we were just creating content and stuff, and I actually wasn't vlogging until someone messaged me like, "Oh, I can't wait for the vlog." That's when I was like, "Oh shit, I forgot to vlog." That topic of like other Instagram influencers kind of inspire us to do more. Ben, who can you think of? Name three dudes that like inspire. So we've got films. Yeah, he's dope. Discovery Channel. <laughs> <laughs> ben Mika, follow me on Instagram. There's a guy named Emmett Skyring. I really like his photos. Ronald Dong. Oh yeah, he's dope. Check him. Just travel influences. Who would you pick? Sam Calder. I really like his stuff. A guy named Leonardo D'Alessandri from Italy. I really like his stuff. It's very really different. Um, like Casey Neistat, I'd like to hang out with him someday and kind of pick his brain about like, everything. He's a really interesting person and he's well traveled too. My travel influences that I like following um, Tara Milk Tea. She's like my favorite Instagrammer, even though she's like a girl and like does all these like girly photos. It's like real dope, she's real colorful. Um, and she goes to all these like amazing places that I try to like imitate or you know. Watch her style and just try to create from it. Do you travel in Gypsy Lust? The combo makes such a sweet, like, oh, everything they do with bangers. Their last Bailey photo banger. Oh, the homie Logan Dodds from New Zealand. He's um, he's one of the dudes that like always like when I see him do stuff, I'm like, damn, I want to get out too. YouTuber wise, travel, travel, travel. Splits around the world. Yeah, yeah, true. He's a traveler. I like Logan Paul. Got all his merch. No, I don't. Peter McKinnon. 
I like his stuff though, puts me in a good mood. It makes edits. Whoa. Over here you drive on the right side, which is kind of like America. In New Zealand we drive on the left side. And also the steering wheel is on this side of the road. Anyway, check out the beauty. Whoa. super white because of all the sun cream. Now we're walking up this 30 minute walk up a place called, I can't even pronounce because... Ben! <laughs> Often Ben likes to stop and take photos of things. I feel like there's gonna be a sketchy hike, eh? Okay guys, I'm not sweating. And we did not go the wrong way. <laughs> We are back where we started. We walked in a massive circle and then took us 20 minutes and I'm drenched. I've been eating too much French toast. Now we're going back to the beach. You got the key, don't you? <laughs> we are gonna chill here for sunset, I guess. Just dropping in about um, maybe an hour or so. Hey, buddy. Come here. Okay. <laughs> this dog is a scary dog. Okay, I'm gonna put this, this camera away, get some work done. So now we're going back because it's all fish. We just ate at Elo Pizza. That's where you saw us eating, and I would highly recommend it. Chill now. I am one episode behind on Dragon Ball Super. About to catch up tomorrow. It's just going to be another day of relaxation, and I'm heading off to Bora Bora. That's a dream. Never thought that. Tomorrow I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna go sleep now. After I watch Shrimp Super. Peace.